man. There's George. And the thermal. Man. Hold on. There's George out there on oh, 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 the thermal. Shooting. Oh my god. He is a production professional. He's 200 feet away and look at that. We are total lights out. That's not a flashlight he's using at all. Those are infrared beacons that only he, or actually only you, and Bigfoot can see at this point. I'm telling you, I'm looking right down the line, and there's no light. These are infrared beacons. He's modified this camera to show in complete darkness. George, that was awesome. That was awesome. Good. Total lights out. Could you see uh, anything through the viewfinder? I could see you, and what was amazing was it appeared as if you were, you, you were using a flashlight, but you weren't. You were using the infrared lights. Mm -hmm. Which are in, invisible to human eye, which theoretically, if Bigfoot has mitochondrial DNA, human DNA going back 15,000 years, as the Ketchum Project pointed out, then that light would be invisible to a Bigfoot. So you were actually moving closer to finding the Bigfoot, uh, unlike the TV show. Well, Bigfoot wouldn't be afraid, he would be sticking his head up. And looking, but he may not see that because he thinks he's in the dark. Well, he he would be in the dark. He would not have seen the light that you were presenting. But he won't be in the dark to us. No, because we have the technology. Um, he doesn't have that. Wow. Wow, that was that was awesome. You get about four or five of these lights. A couple of people. Okay, we we need to we need to, to uh, come up with we're we're staring right down this path. Uh, well, here you you get two guys. Each guy has two lights, so four lights, two guys. The two guys they they go out mm -hmm. into the dark where they think there's a squatch. Yeah, but it's pitch dark. Well, it's pitch dark. Just so my viewers are seeing right now is total darkness. They're not seeing anything because there is nothing to be seen. I can I. You're two feet in front of me, George. I cannot see you. Right, because it's really, there's no moon. It's no, a it's a new moon. We deliberately planned this to be under the new moon. And you were, I cannot see you. But I could see you clearly through the viewfinder when you were using the infrared lights, which Bigfoot, if he has mitochondrial DNA, which Melba Ketchum and uh, David Pilatus claim it has, then it would not have seen you, and you would have been able to get that much closer to it. Okay. This is awesome. This is wicked. Let me turn this off because I want to think of what we can do for in, in the next couple of minutes to make a real plan of action here and hold on. Is it off? Yeah, yeah, um... Straighten my uh, 